the concept for the music video of Sasagipin Kita, we really wanted to tackle a few issues that are relevant in the society today, which is like mental illness, depression, and anxiety. So we got to interview a few people who were so kind to open up to us about um, everything that's been bothering them and how they've coped with it. In the music video, I also have parang love interest in uh, Sasagipin Ko in a way. So yeah. When I think about work, I really kind of stress over what I'm going to be performing, if it's like a difficult song or not. And also, I get really excited to, to work and uh, do stuff like this, like shoots and interviews and um, of course meet new people and hang out with fellow artists as well. I guess I prepare differently for each thing that I do. If it's a music video shoot, I try and sleep as much as I can the night before because I know it's gonna be a long day. And when it's recordings, I try to vocalize a bit um, earlier. I want my voice to be open, of course, while I'm recording the song. And then when it's performances, uh, I really try and run everything in my mind before going on stage. And I learn my material, I vocalize, and I mentally prepare myself. And sometimes, like the nerves still get to me, even like up, even now, up till up till now. Before I go on the stage, I feel like puking sometimes, and I don't know. I just start shaking. But when I'm on the stage, everything goes away, and uh, I just kind of enjoy the moment. So yeah. Oh well, I guess doing a movie was really different from what I usually do. And that's definitely a milestone for me because I've always wanted to try acting. And acting has always fascinated me as well as a kid. Um, how the, the actors get into character so well, like right when the director says action and learning the whole process behind the movie from the sets and everything. It's, it's just, it's really cool to see everything in, in progress and working with everyone as well. So it's a different environment for me too because I usually sing and dance, but then there it's me portraying a different person in somebody else's life. So yeah, I, I would definitely want to try doing it again. For me, when I sing, I like it's important to sing with emotion, as they say. So I guess that helped with acting because it's it's different when you really f when you really feel it and don't try to push yourself to like to cry or anything. And I didn't get to do workshops before doing my mo doing my first movie, so it was nice to have all my co-actors and the people on the set helping me telling me how to improve this, improve that. And also, I, I learned so much. I picked up a lot from, from them, not just as an artist, but as a person as well, and um, discipline and professionalism and everything like that. Um, a lot of people ask like, oh, is it weird when people take pictures of you? Or is it weird when you see people taking pictures of you without you knowing? And I'm just like, oh, well, now I'm kind of used to it. It's really something you definitely have to get used to. It's not something that I guess, I don't know. It's just something that's very new, especially to me. And people ask like, oh, when you get on stage, do you always feel nervous or is it do you never feel nervous? I don't know. They ask like a lot of random things, especially like my, my, my old friends back in Canada. And of course my family members as well. So I guess it's fun as well answering all their questions and stuff. I feel like when people ask me how are you, it's like mandatory to say oh I'm good, I'm fine. And you just don't go into like, and you don't go into context, you don't go into detail about it. But I guess that's one, not just for me, it's one important question for like everyone, kahit wala sa showbiz industry. And I feel like that's one of the questions that a lot of people would appreciate more. 